By now, I'm sure you're hearing a lot about the coronavirus or COVID-19, and maybe it's bringing you a lot of stress or anxiety. Even the word virus can be a little spooky. We're gonna talk a little more about it and also how you can stop the spread. First of all, what is a virus? A virus is an eensy teensy particle that can enter your body and make you really sick. It can be spread by touching, sneezing, coughing, or even just breathing on someone. It's important that you keep a safe distance from each other, at least six feet, which is the length of your bed at home, and also that you cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. And lastly, but most important, you need to wash your hands with soap and water, lots of it, um, because COVID-19 spreads through your mouth and your nose. Ew! <laughs> and your eyes, so don't touch your face. Just don't do it, even if it tickles. Just don't, don't do it. it. Let's talk about another scary word, which can even be scary for adults, quarantine. Quarantine basically means when you get a virus that you're separated or quarantined away from other people um, so you don't spread the virus to them. Let's break it down a little bit about quarantine. Do you remember that one time when your indoor dog got sprayed by a skunk? Yeah, she smelled so bad. Did your mom let him come back into the house immediately and lay on the couch? No, we sprayed her down and then we left her in the barn house for a while until she smelled much better. That's exactly what a quarantine is. Um, if you get COVID-19 and you're sick, you need to stay at home, maybe in your comfy pajamas and away from other people. See, that's not so scary. And even if you know someone that's quarantined, you can still keep in touch with them. You could call them or send them a text. Or even FaceTime. Or you could send them a letter in the mail. Okay. Yes, the situation is very serious, but it won't last forever, especially if we follow health guidelines, which include social distancing, covering your mouth when you cough or sneeze with your elbow, not your hands, and be sure to wash your hands for 20 seconds with soap and water and also stay at home. And I know sometimes staying at home can be really boring, but there are lots of things you can do at home, like reading a book. Or watch a movie. Or going outside for some fresh air. Or bake cookies and brownies. Yum. Yum. Or doing your homework. Hopefully we've helped you understand more about COVID-19 and also how you can stop the spread. It's important to stay calm and we also hope that you can enjoy this time with family. Last but not least, if you ever feel worried or afraid, we hope you will talk to a trusted adult um, or someone else that you can talk to that cares about you to talk about those feelings. Because we're, we're all in this together. together.